Afton was shunting some trucks for Sydney when Sydney pulled in right next to him. Oh, Sydney, said Afton. I thought you were coming in two hours. Oh, uh, said Sydney. I kind of forgot where I was going. Oh, well, that's all right. I'm just shunting your train now. So, if you'll excuse me, I'll just get it ready for you. And Afton shunted the flatbeds into another siding. And as Afton pushed the trucks, he pushed them over the turntable so he could quickly go get Sydney's brake van. As Afton was about to get Sydney's brake van, he forgot to mention that Sydney could just go and grab his cars. Uh, Sydney, said Afton, you can go a couple up to your trucks. I've still got to get your brake van. Oh, right. And Sydney quickly went towards his trucks, and Afton quickly sped off to grab Sydney's brake van. And when Afton grabbed Sydney's brake van, he quickly sped off to go couple it up to the rest of Sydney's train. And when Afton coupled up Sydney's brake van to the back of his train and then coupled, Sydney thought it was time for him to go. And he honked his horn and quickly sped off. Wait! shouted Afton. Sydney, wait! And he chased after Sydney. It was too late. As Afton chased after Sydney, he quickly rounded the bend and left the yard. Ha, ha, ha! Afton sighed. Oh well, I guess he'll come back. If he forgets his way, that is. And Afton was right. As Sydney rounded the bend, he completely forgot where he was going. Um, I think I'm supposed to go to the diesel works, Sydney said. As Sydney pulled into the docks, he decided to ask Cranky and where the diesel works was. Oh, uh, Cranky! Uh, yeah, Cranky down here. Do you know where the diesel works is? Sydney said. The diesel works? Why are you trying to look for the diesel works? I thought you were supposed to be on the mainland pulling a goods train. Um, to be honest with you, said Sydney, I actually forgot where I was going. So, oh well, I'll figure it out of myself. And he honked his horn and quickly sped off. Well, this'll be fun, said Cranky. Meanwhile, Afton was shunting trucks in the yard, getting ready for another train, when he heard Sydney's horn, and Sydney quickly rounded through the station and quickly into the yard. As Sydney rounded the bend to the yard, he had completely forgot where he was going. Oh no! shouted Sydney as he saw the line of trucks that Afton had shunted. Sydney braked with all of his might, but it didn't work. He quickly zoomed forward and crashed into the tankers, sending his freight cars flying over the others. Oh my goodness, shouted Afton. Are you okay? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm fine, Afton, said Sydney in her groggly voice. Oh, I kind of forgot where I was going. Of course you did. Well, I've got to go get the breakdown train, so... Afton quickly uncoupled from Hector and went to go get the breakdown train. When Afton finally got back with the breakdown train, he did not know where to start. Uh, Sydney, I hope you don't mind the wait. This will take a while, said Afton. Oh, don't worry about it. I won't be going anywhere anytime soon. And with that, Afton started work on the wreckage.